force upon the South what they are not ready for would result in nothing but more racial hatred. Dr. W.E.B. Du Bois, he's perhaps the most eminent Negro scholar in America. He comments, it's a silly waste of money, time, and temper to try and compel a powerful majority to do what they are determined not to do. And finally, the youth ministry car wash was a smashing success, raising over $900. Now, does anyone have any announcements, prayer, concerns? Amanda. Ryan Winkler? Who wants to know? Dallas PD. You didn't happen to beat up a vending machine about a week ago, did you? Congratulations, you got me. Go ahead and send the bill to my uncle. He owns a place. Oh, your uncle owns the Legato Hotel? Yeah, he does. Mr. Winkler, have you had a flu shot this year? No. Why? Looks like you're a little light. Of course, I'm sure we can work something out. Oh, damn. You bit me. I thought you boys liked it rough. You want more? Damn right I do. Give me what I want. Tell me those freckles don't miss me just a little bit. Hey, Travis. And here I was worried that you might not have gotten an invite. Oh, I get a lot of invites you don't know about. Lindsay and I, we still got that psychic connection going on. Don't we? You know what? Listen, hey, buddy, it's late, so why don't I just have someone drive you home to your trailer? We'll call it a night. Hmm? You still got that tattoo I bought you, Lens? Bet even Bobby hasn't seen that one. You got her thinking you're so in love. But there's a lot of days I drive by and there's no car in that driveway. You don't think she gets lonely and calls me? I'm gonna have to fill in. What's up, Sebastian? Jeremy, what up? Thought you were going to football camp with the rest of the jock suckers sucking jock. <laughs> no, man. The last football's not for me. It's got cheerleaders got it made. Do Come you on. realize how much ass we're going to get this summer? I don't think so, Sebastian. You might just get a little pissed if I'm pulling ass. When it comes to law in Texas, it don't matter what you want. You do as I say or I put your ass in jail. That's how that works. <laughs> They're gone! I need a man! Come on! Here you go. I'm down! I'm holding. Let it be my shoulders that bears this weight. Your name is Amina Yesin. You're a Chechen rebel, only posing as an American. You're staying at the Oleando Hotel. The same hotel that coincidentally the Ukrainian president is speaking at in four minutes. Where is the bomb? <laughs> Tell me! Julie. 